Welcome back guys, it's Brandon. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button before we even get started today. What we are gonna be doing is going over a holiday gift guide for your significant other. This could be male or female. I feel like these are gifts that I would want, so I think it's more geared toward the male perspective, but it could go either way. But for today's video, it's probably gonna be more of a, a male-based gift. Anyways, let's get started. All right, guys, gift number one, plain and simple. A good old bottle of wine or a bottle of whiskey. It doesn't have to be wine or whiskey. It could be any sort of bottled alcohol, but today that's what it's gonna be, wine and whiskey. into detail about the wine you know who your person likes red whites you go for it they're gonna love it if they love wine they'll love whatever you pick because you got it for them now today I'm gonna be recommending a whiskey 1856 uncle nearest if you live anywhere anywhere down in Tennessee you've had a bottle of this and it is rare to get anywhere up north so if you can find this in your local store, it's pretty reasonable. I would say anywhere between 40 to $60, depending on where you go. I think I got this for like 52, 55, but they'll love it if they're big whiskey drinkers. Gift number two. This one's definitely probably gonna be, definitely probably be, yeah. It's most likely going to be geared toward the man in your life but it was judging i know some girls that have smoked some cigars so that's gift number two a good old cigar so you can pick these up in almost anywhere depending on where you go i guess uh i know you can't get them at cvs anymore because well you know why but pick this up at your local gas station for a, a cheap cigar but that's probably not what you're going for if this is a gift for a special occasion, Valentine's Day, maybe another holiday, it's coming up. So I would recommend going into an actual cigar shop and going into their little nice section of cigars and the local cigar uh, guy that's there will be more than happy to recommend you a cigar. He he has the knowledge and he would definitely know what you would be looking for. So a cigar, easy enough. Now, if you already know that your person loves cigars and maybe they just want an accessory to their cigar, I would recommend getting them a cutter. I mean, yeah, they have the cheap cutters that are out there, um, but I'll put some links below to some of the cutters that I would recommend. Uh, they have certain kinds of cuts. You can do the, the regular guillotine style cuts, or you could go something a little bit more fancy, which I think could be a good gift if they are into cigars, is a V-cut. I'll definitely put a link to a V-cut down below for you guys. Um, but yeah, that'd be gift number two. gift that kind of goes with the cigars and the cutters so I used to travel a lot for work and there's nothing better than to have a traveling humidor what this does is it makes sure that your cigars stay at that perfect temperature so they don't get too wet moldy or even too dry so one of these definitely comes in handy for your traveling other person. All right, gift number three is pretty simple and a standard gift, I would say, for the romantic holidays, but it would be a watch. Um, I'll put a link below of this watch exactly. 
if they still have it on their website. But this is where I got it. It's really very reasonable and it's a great gift. It's sharp, it's got the gold look to it. And yeah, it'd be a great gift for any guy, uh, especially if they're more of the gold flashy look kind of guy. Uh, but any watch, I'm sure they would be happy to receive. Another little bonus is say they have multiple watches and they're just kind of laying out everywhere on their nightstand or a dresser. What I would recommend is a watch box, as you can see here. What it does is it organizes your watches and it kind of gives them more of a, a classy look to it. So definitely recommend the watch box if you are a watch collector. Uh, they get from maybe six watches all the way up to entire uh, like mini fridge style cases. Like they're, they, they can get huge. So yeah, that'd be gift number three. Final gift. Now, let's say you're watching this video and you're trying to get ideas and you're just, you're stumped. You have no idea. And as you're going through, you're like, oh, they, they don't drink any sort of alcohol. They don't like wine, they don't like whiskey. They're just not the, the drinking type. And then you get to number two and you're like, oh, they're, they don't smoke. Like they would not even be interested in a cigar. Brandon, you're killing me. Tip number three watch no they they don't wear watches they have the apple watch or whatever other electronic watch they don't need a watch they wear that all the time so so this last gift is going to be for everybody because if you don't use this last gift then comment below because i want to know last gift shoes. You can never go wrong getting someone a pair of shoes. There are collectors, they are people that just want to have closets full of shoes. You can never have enough shoes. This goes male or female. Everybody loves shoes. So I'll put a link below to, I'll see if I can find these shoes exactly. These are the Adidas NMDs. They're very popular uh, here in 2020. So yeah, I'll put a link below to these, but let's say that your person doesn't, they're, they just, they, they have enough shoes, but maybe they don't have more dressing up occasion shoes. So you can always go that route as well. You can get the, a nice easy pair of slip-ons I mean you could get shoes like this for probably anywhere between 20 to I mean the price is limitless depending on the brand but they're pretty reasonable and I mean they're sharp looking too um, so I would recommend it shoes is a great gift I've gotten uh, shoes my girlfriend's got me a nice pair of boots before and I this was three years ago and I, I still wear them all the time so comment below if you have any other gift ideas that maybe I'm missing out that another viewer might see your comment and be like, oh, that's, that's the gift right there. That's, that's what it is. It's better than the video. So yeah, leave a comment below if you've got a better gift that maybe I didn't mention. And yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope this video solves all your problems and you are good to go on the gifts from here on out. Just keep it a cycle, man. Just get them a bottle of whiskey one holiday and then just get them a cigar the next one, maybe a, a box of cigars, maybe get him two pairs of shoes, her two pairs of shoes. Nah, let's be real. If, if you're gonna get her shoes, it's gotta be at least in multiples of five. So yeah, so that's the rule in shoes. Uh, so after my girlfriend watches this and sees that I just declared a rule that I can't buy her shoes unless I get it in multiples of five, I'm sure she's gonna be very happy about that. So thanks for watching guys. Leave a like, comment, subscribe.